We acknowledge that Treaty 7 territory on which we stand is the ancestral land of the indigenous peoples and is common home to everyone in virtue of God, our Creator's gracious gift. Oh, sing to the Lord, giving thanks. Sing psalms to our God with the heart. He prepares the rain for the earth, making mountains sprout with grass. Name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Always and everywhere we give thanks to God whose merciful love is eternal. Let us begin by joining in words of praise. Glory to God in the highest and on earth, peace to people of good will. We praise you, we bless you. We adore you, we glorify you, we give you thanks for your great glory. Lord God, heavenly King, King, oh God. Almighty Father, Lord Jesus Christ, only begotten Son, Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. You take away the sins of the world. Receive our prayer. You are seated in the right hand of the Father. Have mercy on us. You are alone, the Holy One, you alone are the Lord. You alone are the Most High Jesus Christ with the Holy Spirit in the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. Lord God, great is your goodness and many are your gifts. Teach us to use wisely the gifts you give us. Help us to love others and take care of their needs that we may one day live in the joy of your kingdom. Through our Lord, Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and regions with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the first letter of Paul to Timothy. Try your best to please God and be like Him. Be faithful, loving, dependable, and gentle. Fight a good fight for the faith. 
the word of the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Our response is, O oh God, let all the nations praise you. O oh God, let all the nations praise you. O oh God, be kind and bless us. Be pleased and smile. Then everyone on earth will learn to follow you, and all nations will see your power to save us. O oh God, let all the nations praise you. O oh God, let all the nations praise you. Let the nations celebrate with joyful songs because you judge fairly and guide all nations. O oh God, let all the nations praise you. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Mighty One has done great things for me, and holy is his name. Alleluia, alleluia. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. On one occasion, Jesus said, My Father, Lord of heaven and earth, I am grateful that you hid all this from wise and educated people and showed it to ordinary people. Yes, Father, that is what pleased you. My Father has given me everything, and he is the only one who knows the Son. The only one who truly knows the Father is the Son. But the Son wants to tell others about the Father so that they can know him too. If you are tired from carrying heavy burdens, come to me and I will give you rest. Take the yoke I give you, put it on your shoulders and learn from me. I am gentle and humble and you will find rest. This yoke is easy to bear and this burden is light. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. So that being thankful makes you happier. Even when it seems there's not a lot to be thankful for, just saying thank you for what we do have makes us happier. And when we're happier, we begin to notice there are, in fact, more things to be thankful for, like friends, like family, and people that love us, and even for our own selves. We are each made in the image and likeness of God, which is pretty awesome when you think about it. It's not that we have superpowers like the Justice League, but that we have a mind and a will to do good and create justice in the world. St. Paul tells us that three things are most important, even during times like these, faith, hope, and love, and that the greatest of these is love. This Thanksgiving, let love be our superpower, and let's be thankful for all the love and all the good things that we do have. I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving. T is for being thankful that we attend Monsieur J.J. O'Brien School. H is for the happiness that everyone deserves. A is always believing that something wonderful is going to happen. N is for the nature and beauty for which God has given us. K is for kindness, gentle worlds, and, and thoughtful deeds. S is for spending quality time with our families. G is for gratitude, our blessings, great and small. I is for ideas, letting risen grow tall. B is for voices, singing, laughing, and always caring. I is for inspiring others to always be humble. N is for never giving up. G is for giving of yourself to the Lord our God. Because the Son has revealed the Father to us, we have come to know the Father, to the one who, lo who alone provides true rest for the weary. We present our needs for all the members of the church that they may be filled with the Spirit and pattern they, their lives after the example that Christ will pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. 
For the leaders of nations that they preserve in the efforts to bring, bring unity, peace, and healing to the world. We pray to the world, Lord, hear our prayer. For those weary in body, mind, or spirit, that they may find in Christ the rest they long for, and in Christ's disciples the ascent assistant they need we pray to the lord lord hear our prayer for all who provide food for the world that they be blessed with rich harvest we pray to the lord lord hear our prayer for all members of our school community and our families that they may celebrate thanksgiving with fullness of joy and always remember to give praise and thanks to God for all good things. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the needs of all who have asked for our prayers, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. O oh God, whose Son gives us a yoke that is easy, a burden that is light, lift our spirits by granting these praise. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. At the Savior's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray. O oh God, you show us your love and mercy for us through Jesus. Help us to live with thankful hearts and share with others all that we have received from you. Through Christ our Lord. Amen.